Yeah. No, no leftovers for a while. What is today? National leftovers for the lab day? I think so. And? December 1st. <laughs> and? The first day, sorry, I'm filling up a water. You probably can't even hear me. Are you my um, videographer? Sure. I'm back. It is the first day of the best day of the year. It's Vlogmas. Vlog Ember. <laughs> I don't even know the last time I posted a vlog, which is pretty crazy. I'm sorry to have left you all hanging. Let's see when the last time I posted on YouTube was. Do you have a guess? No, no. Take a guess. Should I do Vlogmas? Yeah. Um, <laughs> how, do I, how do I even look? Erin Gilfoy. Nine months ago. Well, that's sad. So almost a year, but here we are. I couldn't miss Vlogmas. That is just a sin. We're starting off with my Spotify wrapped. We always do this. It's wrap time. Ready? Let's do this. If you're listening, took you places. One place listened just like me. Burlington. We should... We're from Vermont, I guess. We well, it's because I listened to Noah. So much Noah. Wait, I played 1,669 songs. <laughs> oh. Noah. Northern Attitude, 46 times this year, starting on January That's 17th. That's your top song. Yeah. But you had room in your heart for more than one favorite. What is it? My tops. Oh my God, they're all Noah. <laughs> <laughs> no variety whatsoever. Wow, I listened to 20,000 minutes. I feel like that's more than last year. I couldn't get enough of Karma. Okay, that's simply not true. <laughs> Taylor, Noel, Taylor, Noah, Olivia, and Noel. Yeah. <laughs> My top podcast was Smartless. I love Smartless. Okay, well, no surprises here. I truly thought that that would be my top five. I was right. They are the same artists whose albums I like could go back to all the time. And then, like for the most part, in terms of music, I just like play playlists based on that artist. Like you can click artist radio, and that's what I really love about well, Spotify. Here's the thing that I feel like is fucking this both up is like, I don't know if it registers the Sonos plays. I don't ever use Sonos. I always play Spotify through the things because Sonos app doesn't work for me. Well, I always use Sonos. I know. TJ, TJ had a good Spotify. What were your top five? Taylor Swift, Skrillex, <laughs> Zach Bryan. That's great. The Grateful Dead and Alex G. A real um diverse king. Such a diverse king. I made a cinnamon raisin bagel with strawberry cream cheese. We are about to go to the gym, so I need to eat this. And then we're gonna go. And then I have a pretty busy day, so stay tuned. I am on my way to get my hair cut, but I feel like I should do like a, f a better formal introduction. This morning has been like a little chaotic. My parents have been staying with us for the last nine days and they left this morning at 5.30 and I had to call them an Uber because <laughs> my mom didn't know what it was. <laughs> she was like, so do I just like call them and then they'll come? And I was like, no, I will do it for you. So for some reason, even though I had my phone on do not disturb, it like sends off a notification when they are a certain distance away and it went through my do not disturb and woke me up at 5.30 and then I could not go back to sleep. So. I was in a little bit of a daze earlier when I was doing the Spotify wrapped, but I've got my coffee. We are good to go now. It's a little past nine. I'm going to get my hair cut. And I think I mentioned earlier that I have a pretty busy day. Carly and I have to pre-film a ton of stuff because TJ and I are leaving for Utah like we normally do. And we're gone for quite some time. So Vlogmas is gonna be a lot of, I'm going to film with Carly, I'm going to the gym. I'm going to film with Carly, I'm going to the gym. And that's basically just my life. I have missed filming and uploading on my channel, but I, again, I've been extremely busy, but I am so excited. Like obviously can't miss a Vlogmas. I feel like it, it's gotta be year like four or five that I've done this. I'll have to fact check that, but I definitely have been doing it since I lived in my old apartment, which was in 2019, 2018. I'm just, I can't remember which year I started, but it doesn't really matter. Well, I'm gonna drive and get my hair cut. Guess what day it is? Vlogmas day one. More importantly, we need to know. Is it Vlogmas day one? It is Vlogmas day one. We need to know Carly's Spotify wrapped as per tradition. Do you even need to ask? Well, I'm assuming Taylor is like your top artist. Only. It's the only artist you listen to? Well, I think. I saw your songs on your story. Okay. I think like maybe at the end. Oh! <laughs> <laughs> oh. <laughs> oh. 
Oh, seven thousand. Is that a lot? <laughs> no. What, what was yours? Twenty. Oh my god. Yeah, I don't like listen. To I know. All. Someone someone had like seventy five thousand, and I was like, Jesus I feel Christ. Like people, like, I have it on all day. Yeah. I, okay. Wait. What are the rest of your things? Like going this way. Oh yeah. No. It, okay. So Taylor, oh, Kelsey, Kelsey Ballerini, which is like I probably listened to her like four times this year. Nineteen seventy five. Which is weird for me because I feel like I don't... You know what happens? Because <laughs> I listen to Shuffle Taylor Swift on my walks. And they come on. Yeah, after so many times I skip. Yep. It's Kelsey Ballerini in 1975. And then Nolan. <laughs> oh, really cute. cute. Wait, did you see Nikki DeMar was on her own Spotify? She was. <laughs> yeah. Icon. Uh, me if I was an artist. And then, Erin, you're going to die. You will not believe her number. Okay, let me guess. Um, guess. Is it a girl or a boy? It's a boy. Something um, has to do with something that was in our life this year at a certain event mm -hmm. that we go to once a month. Emo night. Yeah. Okay, so it was like, it's an emo band. It's not even emo. Um. <laughs> it's so funny, you're gonna die. Give me a hint. Um, early 2000s-ish. Oh God, that doesn't help. I know. Cause I feel like it all is. Oh, you're right. It's not pop punk. It's not like what you would think emo. It's not even like in that genre. It's like something I listened to when I was in high school. That was, uh, it's a one, it's a guy artist, singular. Not Skrillex. Not Skrillex, no. I don't know. Maybe like, a, give me the first letter. R. R? At Emo Night this year? Yeah. R? Oh my God. You're going to say it and then I'll know. You're, yeah. Did you like come specifically for it? Um, I was going anyway, but I was like excited. R? <laughs> yeah. And it's funny. Yeah. Ryan Cabrera. Yeah. Oh my God. <laughs> I probably like... <laughs> The night you told me, I, pro I pulled it on yeah. my way home, which is a two-minute drive, yeah. by the way. And that's probably why it's on there, because Taylor Swift is like... Uh, totally. Really and, like, you're not, really li you're not really listening to a lot of no, music, no. so I feel like it's, like, skewed a bit. L-O. That's very funny. What were... Oh, your top songs were all Taylor, right? Yeah. The Great War, Karma, Now That We Don't Talk, Lavender Haze, Is It Over Now? Which I feel like it's a pretty wow. good, like, grouping, because those are, like, things that just came out. Totally. It told me that Karma was my, like, most listened to Taylor song, which I just simply don't believe. Huh. What do you think it is? Not Actually. that. We're recording a bonus episode. That'll be up. So join your Patreon. Oh. Patreon.com slash OnlyFriends. Only and you can submit questions at OnlyFriends696969 at gmail.com. Dog well, Carly and I finished recording our bonus podcast. It was very funny. So make sure you're part of our Patreon. And then I ate lunch and laid down on the couch. I'm so tired from being up since 5.30 in the morning. But the past couple days I've been watching this new show on Netflix. <clears throat> I don't know if it's called Squid Games, but it's like real people competing in like what the TV show was, which I never watched. <laughs> what? <laughs> I also never watched. It. You didn't? I thought you did, but you were like, I it's not it good. I just couldn't get into it. Yeah, too scary for too me. Violent. Yeah, this one's like that, but with no death. But every, it's like very emotional. Honestly, like watching it, I feel like people who have like high anxiety wouldn't be able to do. Like I feel really bad the whole time I'm watching it, <laughs> but it's pretty interesting. Now TJ and I, what do I say? I mean, you can if you want to. I don't care. We are to going to look at condos to potentially buy the real goal is that i want to buy a condo and then have my best friend move in it <laughs> and we'll just rent it to them but ideally it would be like some sort of investment property i'm sorry this is so dark i'm using my og g7x from probably like eight years ago it's the canon it's just so big it is big and the sony's not working there's just a lot of camera issues and like uh, it looks like it's gonna downpour it'd be like monica church and give tours of the apartments i know oh <laughs> i am a real estate agent i love those videos <laughs> see what kind of footage i can take if the apartments are empty then i'll probably record it but if not i would feel uncomfortable invading somebody's space so i'm sure you understand how's it going for you i am just trying to get through these last three weeks so that we can go to utah i have two really big shows friday is uh the nine year anniversary of emo night whoop, whoop. and then on december 15th we have a show at the la coliseum which is like a concert like a real concert with it's gonna be very cool djs Who's, we got state champs <laughs> that's like all i know <laughs> said the sky state champs we the kings and oh yeah nerpco and it's like kind of a crossover between electronic and emo stuff because before you liked edm you liked, you liked emo um that'll be really fun i'm so excited to see state champs i love them the sky my goodness 
That is scary. Oh my gosh. Don't like that. It's 4.30 now. We saw Three. two? Two. We went to one, but we couldn't get in. <laughs> it was truly like the hardest walk of all time to figure out. Um, we'll probably go back to it this weekend. And then we saw two. I didn't record one of them because somebody was living in there. And again, I that's too invasive for me. But the one I did show you, that was like staged. And I think that was my preferred of the two that we saw. Mm -hmm. What are your vibes? Go with whatever you like. What? <clears throat> no, that did, that's not. <laughs> <laughs> you know better than me. This is like a great area a where we are. <laughs> <laughs> well, I just think like one, that one was a townhouse. The other one that you guys didn't see was not a townhouse. And it was in a much bigger complex. This mm -hmm. one was in a very small complex. Mm -hmm. Um, no elevator, you go right to your door. And I think just with like, people have dogs, that's easier. People need to like leave, not have to deal with the elevator, that's easier. There, I don't know. I think that one was better. Well, back to the house. I am exhausted. I am so tired. <laughs> oh, I can show you guys our Christmas decorations. I obviously did that before Vlogmas because um, we did it like a week ago. Okay, it's bedtime, but I want to show you guys, oh my, I want to show you guys that my whole entire face is breaking out and I'm missing a fingernail and just, you know, keeping it real. That is not what I want to show you. I want to show you our Christmas decorations. P, you so cozy. Good girl. Oh, good girl, P. Are you smiling? You say hi. Hi, everybody. Okay, here is the tree. It is the same as always, but TJ's mom sent him his Christmas ornaments from when he was a little kid. And like, it's funny because so many of them are like little baby ones. This was his. <laughs> he had a huge crush on her. So, you know, just wound, had to wind up with a redhead. Um, this was one he made. I, <laughs> I'm unsure. This one is so cute. It says 1992. This camera's having a very hard time focusing because the lighting, but I think that's so cute. These little ones are just so sweet. I feel like I've shown you guys all of mine from when I was a kid. I've had them for like years, but that's the tree. Honestly, like everything is the same for the most part. We have our nutcrackers. Maybe I'll get a new one this year. Keep the nutcracker family going, this little one. We got this, we just went to Los Alamos and it's in California, it's like wine country. We got this little guy from like local artists who like made stuff. And then these are, we've just had for years. You guys have seen these, I'm sure. We just have this guy. We've got out the Bing Crosby record. Our friends when we hosted Thanksgiving brought this over. So I think it's from Trader Joe's. So we'll do this with Paris. And then here we have, you guys obviously have not seen this, our little whitey shrine. I put the little um, white deer with her, the little snow globe. It's our little whitey shrine. If for some reason you do not know, whitey passed away a couple months ago. So it is pretty sad. This will be the first Vlogmas that there won't be like, footage of her at the end of the video but may her memory live on forever in vlogmas <laughs> sorry um okay we know what the people want and i gotta go get it come on paris let's go to bed good girl my baby everybody wants to know all right <laughs> the first shout out of Vlogmas. 2023. I actually had to go back because there were no comments because you haven't posted. So I had to go way back to <laughs> last year. Oh, yeah. In preparation for this moment. Mm -hmm. And the 
The shout out of the video goes to <laughs> Kells. Wow. <laughs> From Ohio? Nope. Mm. <laughs> <laughs> from Los Angeles now. Oh, right, right, right. Yeah. yeah, he moved. I forgot. Kels, you go, girl. You go, girl. Well, thank you guys for watching day one of Vlogmas. Also, I just caught up on all like our Bravo shows for this week. We watched um, Real Housewives of Beverly Hills. Kyle is absolutely in love with Morgan Wave. You can't convince me otherwise. And that's the tea. Paris. <laughs> Come on, last night you played. She said not tonight. Not in front of the camera. <laughs>